Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. So I wanted to come on today and share a little bit of what I've been creating, um, which hasn't been much because I've been sick all week. <laughs> but um, I was able to do a couple little things, so I thought I'd share with you real quick. Um, first off, um, I did show these on my um, Instagram, put a picture on there. These are um, these tiny little um, poison tags. I think they turned out so cute. So cute. So, um, let me show you each one here. How cute. Just tiny little things. You can just decorate them however. I just put tiny little pieces of you know, pieces of spider web and um, little pieces from uh, accessory pieces from some of Scrap Diva's um, die sets. So, um, let me show you. This is Erica's information here. This is, um, sorry, I'm really kind of out of it. I'm all over the place. So, here's all of Erica's information, all of her social media. <clears throat> and there's the website scrapdivadesigns.com okay I'll make sure I have everything linked um, below but so here's the cute little tags that I made so what I used on this one I'm using this um, poison bottle shakers so um, it's got the two different sizes of um, bottles and it comes with the shaker piece so you can make shakers out of them it has a cute little layering piece for the cork really cute and then they each have um, a tag that says poison. It's got a stitched embossed mark around it and then the poison is embossed. Um, it might, some of them might actually cut out so I don't know if that was supposed to be that way or if it's supposed to be more embossed. I'm not really sure but um, either way it looks really cute. Um, and then it also comes with the two different sizes of the skull head and then the two different sizes of the bone. So I obviously I use this tiny little um, tag poison tag it's only about maybe a little over an inch um long and then i use the tiny skull and then the tiny bones on it i think it turned out really cute and then the um so the spider is from one of the other sets um i think i cut that one out of the i haven't used the other rest of the set yet this is i think this is from the candy corn um Memdex. So there's cute little um, spider and then I put a little um, bow on top and then this is the spider web. The spider web is from the um, pumpkin uh, mini album set and I just cut it out once out of this white glitter and I just cut it up in pieces and put little pieces on there and then just some pretty striped ribbon and a tiny little flower. Okay and then this one is just um, the tag, um, a cute little cabochon. Um, I attached a pink jump ring around some of this. This here is from, this is pieces I just cut off of, uh, it's a uh, like a garland piece from the Dollar Tree. I love that because it's the black and white, which I always love to love, uh, add black and white. So I attached a pink jump ring around that and then I attached a cute little um, you know, skull charm. So very cute. So there's that. And then this one here is the one with the, the, the skull and then the bones. And then just a little tiny black um, sequin and then some, um, you know, some of the tool from the Dollar Tree. Just stapled that on the top. So I think those turned out really cute. Tiny little things. So I made those. <clears throat> and then next, <clears throat> I made a couple of the um, uh, skull bag topper. And this is, let's see, I can't remember what it comes. I think it's skull bag topper one, two, and three, I think. Um, this is the one, the smallest one. And I also have the biggest one, but I don't have that to show you right here. But um, this is a small one. so. Here's the base piece 
for the bag topper. Okay. And then this is the next piece that layers on. And then this on top of that. And then here's the skull piece. And you also get the bow with the layering piece for that. Okay. Now you can also make this just a skull and crossbones without making it a bag topper very easily. You know, you just use this, these pieces here and just make you a, a, like, you know, an embellishment. Okay. So I made these cute little bag toppers right here. So here's my base piece right here, the bag topper part. Okay, this very back layer here is I cut out of this um, silver foil. Okay, and then the next piece is cut out of the, let me show you. Okay, so here's the space piece for the actual bag topper, okay. This piece here, I cut out of the, the foil, right down here, the silver, okay. So that's the very back piece right there, okay. Then this piece here, I cut using the the um, turquoise color. I'm using um, Hey Pumpkin is the collection I'm using. So that's it has the, a lot of the kind of turquoise color in it, which I love. So there's that piece. Okay, and then I cut the actual skull head out of the white. Okay, and then I did my base of my bow. Here is the blue, and then the layering pieces I did white. Okay, and then that just attaches up here on the top. And then I just cut out a piece of <clears throat> a, a flag and, and just added it there on top of some of this trim from um, Joanne's puffy sticker and a flower. And just, just real simple. Another puffy sticker from a different collection, just a random collection. So I did a few of those. They're all the same, just my flower is a different color on each one. But I think they turned out really cute. And like I say, it'll be a great, a great one also for just to make an embellishment. You don't have to make a bag topper out of it. So very cute. So that is my quick small project share for this week. Hopefully I can get more done. I'm starting to feel better, but yeah, knock me for a loop. So anyway, thank you so much for watching everybody. Hope everybody's having fun making Halloween and um, I'll be back soon with another share. Again, I will have everything listed below, um, all, um, all the links, uh, my affiliate link, if you use that, it gives me a small uh, portion of the um, sale, it doesn't cost you any more. Um, be sure if you decide to purchase anything, you use my um, discount code, it's POLKA10, P-O-L-K-A-10, and um, I'll link the, the dies and I'll link the website, and thank you again for watching, bye.